I live alone. <laughs> and that's fine. You just have to make plans. That's the key, especially if you don't have a normal job, because if you live alone and you don't make plans, here is what happens. You wake up and it just gets darker. <laughs> I caught myself a few weeks ago clutching my cat to my chest, saying, we're all right, aren't we? <laughs> There's no one there taking care of me. There are no rules. I'm now watching the least ethical porn, and <laughs> I don't even know how it happened. I used to say to people, and it was true, I can watch pornography as long as the people in it are clearly smiling and enjoying what they're doing. That is not the case anymore. <laughs> I'm now rarely watching anything unless there is a person in it who has been tricked. <laughs> <laughs> and everything in my fridge is fair trade and organic. The porn is neither. <laughs> just have to make plans, that's the key. You just have to make plans so that life has the illusion of meaning and forward momentum. And that's why you're here. So you've done something tonight, because people tomorrow will ask you, what did you do last night? And then you can say, I went to a live taping at the BBC because I live in London. I'm alive, I'm alive. <laughs> are you though? <laughs> or are you just desperately filling the time so you don't have to feel all the pain? <laughs> well, you came to the wrong show.